What's up, guys? We're back with another slide, and, uh, basically, I'm gonna be discussing more story and lore about a game, except this time it's not about Roblox games, it's about Battle Cats. Now, if you don't know, I really like Battle Cats. I think it's a very fun and cool game, and I think you should play it. I'm not sponsored, but, like, I just like it. Basically, um, I'm gonna be talking about some story parts in the game and for this first episode of this what i plan to do a series um we're we're talking about the cats themselves the things you play as so without further ado let's get on with it okay let's start off with discussing the cats themselves like i said in the beginning and like, how are you sending out billions of cats to their deaths without you running out of cats? Like, a core part of the game is meat shielding. You send out your weaker cats first so your stronger units don't take damage. There can't possibly be enough cats in the world to support all of this across every single player's save file. So, there's obviously something going on behind the scenes that we don't know of and and i'm gonna I, i'm gonna skip to the theory part my theory my theory is that these aren't cats but like artificial beings that resemble cats but like they're made to fight and all that now when you first hear this theory it sounds a bit crazy right but once you examine the evidence it starts to get a little less crazy first of all we know that genetic modification is possible thanks to chevalian's bio which says that it's a, it, it's a loving she was genetically engineered to be a perfect foot soldier or something like that. Um, second of all, a lot of the cats in the game have major bodily deformations that don't res that don't resemble real cats or what this game considers to be cats. And three, in the opening cutscene of the game, it says the de the the developer of the cats, what was questioned on TV. Qu quote the word developer that's an odd choice of words it could have been like thinker of the ideas or something along the lines of that but developer makes it sound like we is like it, it, it just sounds abnormal and it kind of supports my theory it gives more evidence stuff like that of course, this 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 could just be the developers hinting to oh this is a video game and all that developers blah 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 but like I still think it's some evidence and like this theory still has some truth not truth but like it's theory like when you really think about it it doesn't seem that crazy to be honest like it's it's understandable. Like I said, this explains why, how you can send out billions of cats through death without you running out of cats somehow. And two, why did, for some reason you have these weird cats with long legs and the, the, the body of a cow or the body of a fish or a priest cat or something. I don't know. There's a lot of weird cats in this game and... Like, it would make sense if all these were artificial beings made for battle. And with that, the the episode comes to the end. Uh, write down in the comments what you think of this theory. Do you think it makes sense or do you think it doesn't make sense and you disagree with it? Uh, I'd like to hear some of your own theories if you do have theories. And I also acknowledge that there is, like actual battle cats lore something something cat legion versus the doge legion something about that but like these are just little theories i made up it could add to the lore but like it's just it's just something to think about and with that bye bye